it's great to have you here once again. Welcome to our Farm Documentaries channel, the home of agriculture. Today, we will look at molasses as an additive in small-scale silage making on the farm. Let's dig in. Molasses is commonly used as an additive in small-scale silage making, particularly for enhancing fermentation and improving palatability. Here is how molasses can be used as an additive in silage. First and foremost, fermentation enhancement. Molasses contain fermentable sugars, primarily sucrose, which serve as a substrates for lactic acid bacteria, sometimes known as lab, during fermentation. Adding molasses to silage can increase the availability of fermentable carbohydrates, leading to faster fermentation and lower pH levels. This helps to preserve the silage and inhibit the growth of spoilage microorganisms. Secondly, pH reduction. The fermentation of molasses by lab produces lactic acid, which helps to reduce the pH of the silage quickly. Lowering the pH inhibits the growth of undesirable bacteria and molds, improving the stability and quality of the silage. Thirdly, palatability improvement. Molasses has a sweet taste that can enhance the palatability of silage, making it more attractive to animals. This can encourage higher feed intake and improve overall animal performance. Fourthly, moisture control. Molasses has hygroscopic properties, meaning it can absorb moisture from the surrounding environment. Therefore, adding molasses to silage can help control moisture levels, reducing the risk of aerobic spoilage and improving the stability of the silage during storage. Fifthly, nutrient enhancement. Molasses contain small amount of minerals and vitamins, including potassium, calcium, magnesium, and vitamin B. While these nutrients are present in relatively low concentrations, they can contribute to the overall nutritional quality of the silage. Another reason, binding agent. Molasses can act as a binding agent, helping to hold the silage particles together and improve compaction. This facilitates better packing density and reduces the risk of air pockets, which can lead to aerobic spoilage. Now remember, when using molasses as an additive in silage making, it's important to consider the proper application rate to achieve the desired fermentation characteristics and nutritional balance. Excessive use of molasses can increase the moisture content of the silage, leading to fermentation problems and reduced silage quality. As a measure, consult with a nutritionist or agronomist to determine the appropriate inclusion rate of molasses based on the specific forage material and silage making process. That's all for today and thank you very much for watching our videos and please don't forget to subscribe so as to watch more similar videos. Thank you very much until next time.